Hey guys, Sock here from Sock eTicket. In today's video, I want to quickly talk about the latest Samsung Reminders app update that does bring a powerful and highly useful functionality to the Reminders application. So let's dive in and get started right away. So let me pull up my Reminders application. Okay, I'm going to go inside right here. This is the Samsung Reminders app, the Reminder app. You're going to go inside, and if you look at the bottom, we have all Reminders, and now we have a to-do option. Now, when I go to my to-do option, I am actually able to sync all my reminders on my Samsung Reminder with Microsoft Reminder, which gives me some really nice functionality. Now, before I dive into the details, let's make sure you have the latest Reminder app update. So to get the latest Reminders update for Samsung, you want to go click the link down below. It's going to take you to my website. You're going to scroll down just a little bit. Under download, all you want to do is click the link right here. You click the link, it's going to take you to the store. And at the bottom, you'll see an update button. Just click on the update. If you don't see the update, if you just see this just like this, then you're good to go. You're up to date. So that's all you got to do to have that latest update. Now, let's go back here. I'm going to show you something. So here we have it. If I go into my settings, in the past, what you were able to do is you were able to sync your reminders application contents with your Samsung Cloud so it shows up on other Samsung devices. But now you can sync it with Microsoft To Do so you can see your reminders on any device. You can go to the website on your Windows PC, on your MacBook if you have a MacBook, on your iPad, whatever you want. It's going to be synced across all devices. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So let's say you're anywhere, okay, and you have access to a computer, you want to access your reminders, you can go to the any web browser, just search for Microsoft To Do, and that's the website for Microsoft To Do application. You click on it, okay, and you just log into it with your Microsoft account. Once you do that, all your actual tasks that I can see on my Samsung Reminders application is going to show up right here as well, which is fantastic. If I go back here, you can see if I go to all, I have my Samsung Reminder right here, then I have my Microsoft To Do lists right here, and all these actually show up over here on the website that I can access on any computer. As a matter of fact, if I had to click plus here, and if I just add something as a test, just tap on add. Now when I go back over here, it is going to actually sync. It says syncing tasks. The test just appears right there. So the Samsung Reminders application now is a universally useful application beyond just Samsung. You can sync with Microsoft To Do and use it anywhere. You can even go and download the Microsoft To Do application, which is right here. Once I go there, I have the same things available right here. And one more example here, I'm back in my Samsung Reminders, okay? So I'm going to go to my To Do, I'm going to tap on plus, I'm going to say test number two, just to show you guys uh, what happens with this. So save, so it is saved on my Samsung phone, and it's syncing with To Do. Now when I go back into the website, the actual To Do website for Microsoft, let me just refresh this. Let's just refresh this, and you'll notice that the test number two showed up at the bottom right here. And what do I do here also appears completed on this side as well. It just syncs instantaneously. All right, very useful little tool. Get that update, and you are going to be good to go. Now, this application may or may not be available in some countries and some regions, something I simply cannot control. Any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. And for now, guys, have a fantastic day, all right? All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button. And also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.